We had trouble keeping the ball out of the net in the beginning of the season, and our three wins came from three shutouts. I think we've gotten a lot tighter defensively. I mean, you know, I don't even want to count last game, but it, it did count. But <laughs> and we had five minutes against St. Francis, New York, where they scored all three of their goals, and that's been it. I mean, we've been pretty tight, so hopefully we can keep that going. Um, well, every conference game is tough. Um, it's really just putting the points together to, you know, get in that top four. And it was basically because of good defensive efforts. You know, the game is central to start off with the 1-0 victory. And then, uh, you know, a draw with Bryant coming here was, you know, a tough game. Um, but it's a point, so that helped out a lot. And then obviously, uh, the New York trip was, you know, a tough one at first with the 3-1 uh, defeat to St. Francis, Brooklyn, and then getting the point at LAU on the Sunday was, was huge. Uh, you know, you need to get points out of that weekend, so the three there was helpful. Um, and, you know, it was just just grit, just grinding through the games to, uh, to get the points. Um, fortunate enough, we got enough to get in, so. Uh, well, obviously, like, the competition, it's at its peak. Uh, the best teams are in the tournament, so the competition is really high, and there's really no room for error. Uh, it's, it's a winner to go home, so you know everyone's going at their best, and uh, you really uh, have to bring it on that uh, when when the time comes. Yeah, I think that's the most difficult uh, thing at times is having consistent performers. Um, and obviously, with Bailey, the amount of goals he has has been you know great throughout the entire season. And Keen, obviously leading the conference in assists is huge, and then Coop's kind of the general in the midfield. Um, you know, his def defensive efforts have been great all year long, uh, winning head balls and challenges and you know, his distribution out wide to Bailey has been, uh, been key. So uh, having those three guys kind of step it up, their senior year especially, uh, to be consistent the entire year and especially in conference play has been big. Every conference game is so competitive, but uh, I, I think St. Francis Brooklyn's the best team. You just got to be better on the day, that's the difference. Um, you know, they're back four solid. Uh, they have the returning defensive player of the year for the conference. Uh, so they're tough. I mean, hard to break down, especially at their home. Um, but, you know, trying to get them behind is huge. Um, catch them on the counter, hopefully, a couple times, uh, and maybe get a couple, some set pieces that we get a little bit of luck on. Obviously, they got some big guys, but, uh, you know, really for us is just trying to get them behind them, uh, you know, setting Bailey free, and then, um, you know, getting guys and numbers in the box to hopefully be able to uh, counter punch them a little bit. Um, yeah, you know, it's tough. It's going to be a tough game. Uh, it's going to take a little bit of luck for us, I think. Uh, and obviously, again, a big defensive effort to keep them off the scoreboard uh, to hopefully come away with a result. Obviously, they're a very strong team finishing first in the conference and showing defensively, not letting uh, very many goals in at all. So we just have to take our chances because we know we have a pretty potent attack and we just have to make the most of our opportunities and uh, continue to be solid at the back. When we went up there, Early in the season, we focused a lot on set pieces, primarily corner kicks and free kicks, and they have a long throw as well. Um, you know, it's just kind of man-to-man -man responsibility. Uh, you know, it's you against another guy, and you got to come away with the you know the win in that battle. So, hopefully, again, just like um, you know some of the other games, we can kind of man up to that and be equal to that task. Uh, it's going to be difficult, but um, you know, I think they don't give up a lot of goals in Francis Brooklyn, but you know they haven't scored a ton of goals either. So um, you know. They put three against us in about a six-minute span last time we were up there, unfortunately. But, uh, you know, limiting their chances and then obviously just uh, taking the few that we, uh, we get. Honestly, I would say what happened in 15. We beat them one nothing in overtime. Uh, it's certainly not going to be 5-4. And I would say we probably weren't the better team on the day that day. Three points. That's all we need Friday.